Hi, my name is Christine Emerson. I'm a pediatric nurse practitioner and I reside in Rochester, New York. I have a daughter, Julia, who's seven years old, who suffers from refractory epilepsy, which is epilepsy that is not treatable by the current medication or other forms of treatment for epilepsy to date. Um, and I'm in support of the Compassionate Care Act because uh, there is a great potential that medical cannabis could greatly improve her quality of life and potentially help alleviate her from her seizures that she suffers from on a daily basis. Um, I think that the Compassionate Care Act is an all-inclusive bill. It would not leave any patients out, um, patients uh, with MS, glaucoma, um, any autoimmune disease, neurological disease, and I think that having a limited bill would not be sufficient enough for what we need for our uh, New Yorkers who are severely suffering. I really think that getting this compassionate care bill passed would allow people to um, have a better quality of life and potentially even cure some diseases um, such as epilepsy. Um, at this point in time, the Compassionate Care Act has passed the Assembly five times, which we applaud the Assembly members for continuing to press forward with this um, bill. Um, we are urging the Senators right now to at least bring the bill to the floor for a vote. Um, you have constituents in your area who are suffering on a daily basis and this would alleviate that and these are the people you're representing so you're basically telling them that they're not able to um, obtain legally a uh, medicine that would potentially uh, help them live a daily life that's much better than what it is now. So we really do need to get this compassionate care passed this year. We can't wait one more year to have this done. So please urge your senators to um, really you know, champion this cause and step forward and um, it may be uncomfortable but this is what we need to help people in New York.